So guys, with me here is um, uh, Robert from Airbus representative from the UK Brofton factory here. Good morning, Robert. Good morning. And uh, Robert, tell me this huge wing behind, what airplane wing this one belongs to? Uh, this wing is for the A350, so that's our brand new yeah. fuel efficient aircraft. It's largely made of carbon fiber composite material. This one is going on, will be loaded onto the Beluga. It's not being loaded on this Beluga at the moment. It'll be loaded on a later one. And we'll go off to Bremen in Germany, where it will have uh, some extra equipping done. And then after it's finished in Bremen, it will go to Toulouse, where it will be attached to the final aircraft. So I'm standing um, inside the uh, special built hangar here in the Airbus facility. And um, it can handle the uh, Beluga, the A300-600 ST here. And Robert, tell me about more about this hangar. When it was built, and um, you know, this must be specially built just for the Beluga here. Yeah. This um, this is called the Beluga Line Station. It's been uh, opened a couple of years ago, so uh, 20, 2015 uh, was when it opened, and it's a specially purpose-built um, loading bay for the Beluga. And the reason why we needed a specially built loading bay for the Beluga, as you can see there is that it's, it's a tube and it's got a large door at the front of it and that door cannot be opened in wind speeds over 30 knots so what we do is now it can come inside so it completely eliminates the effect of wind on the door on the aircraft so we can we can do loading and unloading in all weathers it completely eliminates any, any weather weather uh, issues so this is an a350 wing jig an empty one that's come in uh, on the Beluga today integral. Now this is the um, this is like a cradle that holds the wing and keeps it stable for when it's loaded onto the aircraft. Obviously this is an empty one so it flew out a few days ago and has now come back empty. So this is an A350 wing. This is the only one that goes in at 45 degrees because of the angle of the, the size of the wing and the shape of the uh, fuselage on the aircraft. Uh, when the other wings that go in will be A320 wings and they will go in stacked on top of each other so they go in horizontally. So we're being loaded on at the moment, two sets of wings, that's four wings in total, for the A320 family aircraft, and these are going to be shipped off to the final assembly lines where they'll be attached to the aircraft. This uh, Beluga can carry uh, four A320 family wings, that's single aisle, it can carry two A330 wings, that's the large long range aircraft, and it can carry one single A350 wing. Robert, what about A380, the largest wing in the world? The only bit of the A380 that will fit on here is the vertical tailplane. So the wings that leave Broughton are shipped by sea to Toulouse and then by road. So they go by road, ferry, road, into the final assembly line to Toulouse. Maximum uh, weight of uh, Chico's Beluga is 165 tons. And so this is um, two men and one yeah. flight engineer? Yeah, two, uh, two pilots and one flight engineer. And usually what is the cruising altitude uh, this plane can fly normally, normally in the air? The cruising altitude for flight uh, uh, 9 uh, kilometers. Uh, About 9,000 yeah. meters yeah. high? Yeah, 9,000 meters. And what is the cruising speed in Mach? The speed is uh, Mach 0.7. Mach 0.7. Exactly, Mike point six nine. Ah, Mike point six nine. Thank you very much. The shape of the aircraft. Thank you. It's a pleasure to be here with you. <laughs>